sign up for uh, dishes that you like to bring and continue reading the Red Book of Revelation. Prayer requests for all church members and their families, recovery for those that are sick and with COVID-19 and others have lost theirs and then I pray for our president mm-hmm. our Navajo Nation president and for our revival in America mm. you know we I think a lot of people are but I'd rather be discouraged than uh, trust the Lord in a time like this. And uh, so that's uh, kind of what I feel from uh, just hearing Christian talk around the land. And then birthdays uh, on uh, Tuesday, Dali, 11-2. Birthday for Dolly. Maybe beep a horn when you're driving by her. Mm-hmm. And then the uh, anniversaries we have Solomon and Gloria. And that will be tomorrow. So all good things are happening, and I hope you are part of that. So thank you for. <coughs> Pastor, um, there was a birthday for Trees on uh, LSA on the 10th, and then Trees is on the 11th. Black, uh, huh? Flats after. Um, the, uh, mm-hmm. birthday, the Trees is 11th. Okay. I love, um, my granddaughter in South Carolina is 16th, and I love <coughs> Edward A. on the 24th. <laughs> the whole All in November? Huh? All in November? Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, oh, and um, Grandma Rose trimming went back to be with the Lord. Yes, yeah, so around, around 9, 10, around there somewhere. Okay. Oh, uh, yesterday morning. Yesterday. Yeah. Rose, Nick. Uh, Rose, Nick. Uh, she went peacefully, that's what I heard. Amen. That wow. She quit eating and all that a week ago. And that would come. Mm. Alice is here, she's, she's doing better. Um, She was having some problems, like, like not, not, though, yeah, I have young, but they're trying to find another place for her. All right. Thank you. Uh, the tracks. Oh, gospel track. They are that's in the store if you like to take some. <laughs> and uh, you can't give it up. All right, we're in the book of uh, Acts, uh, chapter 22. And we'll be reading the 1 to 10. Men, brethren, and fathers, Hear ye my defense, which I make now unto you. And when they heard that he spake in the Hebrew tongue to them, they kept a more silence. And he says, I am verily a man which am a Jew, born in Tarsus, a city of Cilicia, yet brought up in the city, this city, at the feet of Gamaliel, and taught according to the perfect manner of the law of the fathers, and was zealous toward God, as ye all are to stay. I persecuted this way unto death, binding and delivering into prison both men and women, as also the high priest uh, doth uh, bear witness and all the estate of the, of all the elders 
from wh whom I also re receive or, or receive letters unto the brethren and went to Damascus to bring them which were there bound unto Jerusalem to be punished. And it came to pass that as I made my journey and was come nigh to Damascus about noon, suddenly there shone from heaven a great light round about me, and I fell under the ground and heard a voice saying unto me, Saul, Saul, why persecutest thou me? And I answered, Who art thou, Lord? And he said unto me, I am Jesus of Nazareth, Nazareth, whom thou persecutest. And when they were with me, they that were with me saw indeed a light and were afraid. But they heard not the voice of him that spake to me. And I said, What shall I do, Lord? And the Lord said unto me, Arise and go to Damascus, and there shall be told thee of all the things which are appointed for thee to do. And Heavenly Father, we thank you again for the hour to open your word and let me help and help us this morning. Holy Spirit of God, we need to uh, uh, deliver the word to the hearts. The word is a seed and uh, we are trying to sow the seed so help the hearts to receive it. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. You know, Paul had a lot of tough times in his life. Mm -hmm. And like this morning, Sunday school, about his finances, about his health. And uh, probably uh, been prosecuted and uh, a lot of times might have felt disappointed. But look at verse 2140. And when he gave, given him license. Paul stood on the stairs and beckoned with the hand unto the people. And when there was made a great silence, he spake unto them in the Hebrew tongue, saying, Notice that there's a great silence take place right there. Mm -hmm. I believe that Paul had that power uh, to control the crowd. Uh, I mean, uh, those uh, bad group, uh, taunters, uh, slanderers, and uh, just uh, mockers out there are making noise. And yet he could quiet them down and uh, go down again and then look, we'll look at verse 2. And he usually have some... If you're trying to get the crowd to calm down, you're going to, still going to have some people that go like this. Yeah, what's good? About it, what's good about Paul? Notice what it said. And when they heard that he spake in the Hebrew tongue to them, and they kept the more silence. I mean, everybody shut up. You know, we... Wouldn't it be good to have people shut up in church instead of talk among themselves and uh, fool around? You know, Paul had the power back then. You have you didn't have all these electronic means to convey the message, but he was able to control uh, the people because God was on his side. He was... Uh, the, the verse we read this morning, I can do all things through Christ which strengthen me. You know, through Christ we can have power to control these people. And uh, so that's good, you know. Uh, 
just I was thinking about that. And uh, as some probably found out that he can speak in Hebrew and uh, he was uh, a Jew and uh, you know, probably always heard it one way and now it's different. Okay, uh, look at verse 3. Um, using the, the word, the, the ways. You know, uh, Paul uh, said, that way, this way. In his preaching, uh, that way probably was their way. This way is uh, his way, and that was the way. And so, verse two. That's it. Verse three. I am verily a man which am a Jew, born of Tarsus, a city in Cilicia, yet brought up at. In this uh, city, at the feet of Camillo, and taught according to the perfect manner of the law of the fathers, and was zealous toward God, as ye all are this day. He got them in too, huh? <laughs> he said, you too. You too, he did that. And they met Paul, they called it Hun Tia Yaski or Ye, but not a con bash net or left. So Paul, they call Hatsi or what he gave Ado Hebrew, Jananas Tit Lagoet, or her son Yego, not what he gave. So what are you had, Hanna Yahaz, Tahada, a what he is on the Saturday exchange and the things that I seem to know all those. ตาเนี่ยตาเสียเอาเขาเอ๋ยหดเอ๋ยชีสตัดหดที่หดที่หดที่เย็นแล้วนั่นเอาอ่าตอนนี้อ่าท่านเลยอ่าข้าวนาส
being more exceedingly zealous at the traditions of my fathers. You know, that's that uh, he said, exceedingly. Not only just a lot of zealous, but he said, hey, I, I thought oh, it was the right way. I thought that was, uh, he defended it, he uh, protected it. He actually uh, persecuted Christians and put them to death, put them in jail, <coughs> so that he can uh, limit their onslaught of their gospel. And... Uh, that's why he did. I mean, he was uh, truly very excited about what he believed. Yeah. Uh, you know, God is very religious at that point. Paul, uh, his uh, testimony, he was religious, and yet he was against Jesus. Yeah, you know, we have that crowd in our, in our t time. We have religious people that are against our Jesus, the one that can save, not just any Jesus, the one that can save your soul is the one that they are against today. And, and then there are a lot of people that know scriptures, and yet they don't know the Lord. Actually, there are men come up to us on Friday, and he was talking about the number four. And he said, number four is not that, number four is not that. And uh, he, he actually knows some uh, Bible. And uh, he said, 40 years of captivity and all that. I was busy loading up my stuff to get ready to go, so I didn't really sit down to say anything to him. And then he even questioned the Ten Commandments. He said there are actually twelve. And uh, probably, <laughs> probably to get him to something the coming week, though, if I see him again. The next oh, you just did Paul, yeah, what then? Sando nasa, Johnila. I call even uh, Philippians. I forgot to read Philippians. And we'll read that one too. So we won't, uh, you won't think that uh, I might have made up some stories that are scripture that back up while we preach. God was up, I don't read it now. God was up, I read it Ah, Nino, yeah, not only. Philippians 3 4. Though I might also have confidence in the flesh, so say, if any other man thinketh that he whereof he might trust in the flesh, he said, I the more circumcised the eighth day of the stock of Israel, of the tribe of Benjamin and the Hebrew of Hebrews, as touching the law, a Pharisee, concerning zeal, persecuting the church, touching the righteousness which is of the law, blameless. He sounds like Navajo, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Israel, then Shaft on the Adon, Benjamin, though Hebrew, that yes, yes, Shane, Joe, our Yan Hunt, and then I had the Shadi Juden, they are more like us than, than the other nationalities. 
and they have practices that are similar. So, you know, now was going to get saved. Or Tlano, or any tribe in the world can get saved. Or either. So, Kong'e, yet, Paul, the Chinese, yet, say, peace, can't, nahi, no, kishadi, yet, or, yet, on the eight, Benjamin, the Nanish, sent, or, Israel, but, father, Hanish, sent, or, Hebrew, the eight, or, Nepash, shed, or, shed, or, shed, or, shed, or, yan, had, net, Johat, our aunt, nature, eh, Jesus Christ, you know, a person can be sincere and religious and yet be wrong. Hardly, I don't know how long to live. I don't know what end the door, what ego or eat or this order. A coibin nati corn. How about going to John 5? John chapter 5. The Gospel of John chapter 5. And we'll look at um, a verse there. And verse 39. I used to just read through these verses uh, uh, many times before. It says, Search the scriptures, for in them ye think ye have eternal life. It doesn't stop there. And the scripture, they are they which testify of me. me. Talking about the Lord, yeah. You can have scriptures, you can uh, carry a Bible around, uh, you can carry your King James around, but hey, how about knowing the person that this book is talking about, yeah. Uh, they just think that they have life. But they're looking at something that they can see Jesus of. You know, the people, some people in the world don't know if they are Savior. Mm -hmm. I hope that I need that. Mm -hmm. I think so that I need that. I will find out when I get to heaven that that's too late. I <laughs> can <laughs> find out you get to heaven. You won't get to heaven if you're not in. Look at 1 John 5 and 13. 1 John 5, 13. I like this verse because uh, when I lead persons to the Lord, I show them this verse uh, from 10 on down. 13. These things have I written unto you that believe on the Son of God. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's Jesus that ye may know, yeah, that ye may know that ye have eternal life. So you ought to know, yeah. yeah if you're saved, you, should, you didn't know you should. You should know you're saved. You know, if you're not saved today, this is a good day to get saved. Mm. And that ye may believe on the name of the Son of God. It doesn't say believe on the scripture, believe on the name. You know, the, the written word tes uh, testifies of the Lord, the living word. And so, amen to that. Do a lot of your corner, and spare us in the left and the yellow. Now, the source of the yak up is a big, but yes, and the yin got be yet balanced in the left. 
Ato in ato in hodlo in speho tozi. A hod an speho zendo le ro na da sa bacheni steni aske zono. Aya ta ta spe sha shen. A zna ko se pe ni na da da ni sa. Aka zan a eti stra. In foto ni a ni. That's why you need the scripture to get uh, to know the Lord ya. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or other than that, uh, or you won't really know what you're doing. Mm-hmm. You got to have the scriptures. Or even na kapsan spehosan na kapehotisis. So in na 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 hasan hoti hot ahan tiki pad sa yasok na et ako el Jew was the on the Jerusalem naya. Camilla Bosch, ah, I don't think in the hour was a passage and sent a John. A hot arm hit over none of the other day. A quanta. That was the legal way in verse number four, back in twenty two. And I persecuted this way unto death now. This way, na. He get out. He get his own party. Son, to a big ayost na piye is. You know, this way is what he believes now. Uh, he used to believe that way. Now he got out, and he believes believe this way. And uh, so, he's talking about. He's going to explain what's going on with him. And uh so it had is when he now uh such a thing that you was not clean that your your yeah just your faith if you uh, have believed in the Lord you yeah, out of the fan why you believe yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, old ways are past, you know, your, your old way is gone, so you might as well defend what you have and uh, continue that way or this way. And uh, so he said, I persecuted this way. Uh, you know that, you know, I did that. Any way I can, you know, I, back in my young life, I spoke against it. You know, I even uh, said things about people. But, you know, when I got saved, I just cried. The day I got saved, I was up here. I uh, actually started to weep probably halfway down the aisle. And when I got up here, these were the people that I didn't like sitting in front of me. I said, I got saved. You know, I was so happy. And from that day on, I was one of them. I defended them, I work with them. <laughs> Acts 8, number 3. As for Saul, he made havoc of the church entering into every house and hailing men and women, committed them to prison. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, that, that guy isn't that guy anymore. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And he asked, he, what in there? Why did he in this? Eh? Oh, Tlani, I ate a hot eat as a leg. Nisha. You still listen to your hunky talk. Ah, he does. All shook up, eh? That's just easier. Eh, they used to get shook up. So I hope they're not doing that anymore. 
So it's gone, so you might as well quit that and uh, get a new music, new, 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 new beginning, new life. Uh, first Timothy uh, one twelve. Uh, there we read, I thank Christ Jesus, our Lord, who had enabled me, for that he had counted me faithful and put me into the ministry who was before a blasphemer, a persecutor, and injurious, but I obtained mercy because I did it ignorantly in unbelief. Yeah, that's why we all have done ignorantly in unbelief. She found us again because I see it now. Because yet they can't all don't if better houses are not all what he gives me there yet they can they the poor they caught in a court uh Nazi in Spain that's a nail a class in in Spain that and that uh yanda yos ah he upon the shahatros but shah ah needs ego a cool hallado oh has she asked in a ocean as a colia nila i got all that yeah that's that's a life that uh, maybe some of you are living or you have left that and you, now you're uh, on good grounds yeah john got that in the yard uh, keep it up uh, job essence. and then he uh, goes back to Acts 9 actually uh, at verse 4 or 5 as also the high priest doth bear witness and all the estate of the elders he, he, he these people saw him and they can bear witness about, about what he had done to the churches. They can bear witness to what kind of man he was. Mm -hmm. And uh, so they said, he pointed these guys out and said, hey, you know what I did? You know what I used to be? And, uh, and then he, he's on the other side and saying, uh, hey, this is the way to go. And uh, so, back at the uh, Acts 9, we'll look at verse 1 and 2. And that's about his uh, persecuting on the, on the Christians. Acts 9, Ado Asa Ado Naki, and Saul yet. Breathing out threatenings and slaughter against the disciples of the Lord went unto the high priest and desired of him letters to Damascus, to the Son of God, that if he found any of this way, whether they were men or women, he might bring them bound unto Jerusalem. He was on his way, just doing his job, yeah. Uh, he was to bring more to Jerusalem on his way. You know, somebody might knock you off your horse on your way to something, yeah. yeah. You know, I remember a guy that had an automobile accident. He said he was partly pinned. 
<laughs> and he was still alive, just uh, maybe his foot or his uh, part of his uh, limb was pinned under. And he became a preacher. And he said, God, I was wrong. He heard the gospel. He said, I'm wrong. And you're right. Uh, would you please save me? And uh, I need help. And he gave a testimony like that. And he said he, he got saved and rejoiced. And all of a sudden, everything just opened up. And he probably got out somehow. And uh, the main story is about his conversion. And you know, Paul can uh, thought he was uh, somebody. And maybe you think you're somebody. Right. And then uh, God can knock you off of that someday. Uh our eighty corner. I said the net of a shortly well known or that's what low. Nagaha a tapetro tanya. She becart that a child in the shivia. The Neza. Joe had a net at a low air she yet at a clap a card at Tabachut Arso. Oh, that Nanay Tanit, it that now had ashes all the way. The <laughs> So look at verse 6 back at 22. And it came to pass that, that uh, as I made my journey, and was come nigh unto Damascus about noon, suddenly there shone from heaven a great light round about me. You know, something happened to him. You know, that, that day I got saved, you know, that was the clearest message that I have ever saw, heard. The man was saying that, that I was a sinner. I say I am. And I uh, wanted a pro pro progression. What is going to happen next? He said, uh, judgment is going to come. <clears throat> you're going to pay for your sin. And then you're going to be in, in the hell. And then I, I say, I don't want that. What, what's the step next step? And he said, would you get up, come to the altar. So, you know, that was, uh, I was the last person up. My mother, my sister had gone, and then my wife had come, and I was the last one behind. That's the greatest day of my life. Verse 7. And I fell unto the ground and heard a voice saying unto me, Saul, Saul, why persecute thou me? Good question. Why are you persecuting the Lord? You know you're you're actually kicking against a sharp object, 
and Paul uses the word go, G-O-A-D, go. It's a sharp instrument that you poke the, the cattle behind its foot so it will move. It's painful. It's probably like a hot shot. And uh, why would you want to fight against something that's uh, trying to move you along? Uh, get you to come to know the Lord. Why would you want to fight it? And uh, so uh, he's persecuting the Lord. And uh, and then he uh, also uses the Christians uh, as uh, himself in Matthew. He said, if you have uh, visited somebody in prison, he said, you have visited me. <clears throat> And so Christians, if you persecute the Christians, you're persecuting the Lord. If you don't want the word, that's what you're doing. So what he would eat a heart, eh? So she would ask her to eat a lot of honey. Then he see him, and she don't know if she's best, and oh, you're born as she. Had in a corner, eh? And then her daughter asked her only. And her daughter, I, she's best, and why the house and say, I don't know, I can't say. ตรีดีทายาสิโอนเนอะคอนดาชอบเลยเอ๋ดอนสนะขาสิตอบิฮาสติโอนานสนาสตาเดียชนะหันตาเอไอดีเนกัตคอนซีอินเตอะคอเอ
Ahut aba nana tasa. Yeah, I just stop that. Stop the trend and change it and uh, be a Christian and that'll be good, yeah. Of course, even in uh, Second Timothy chapter 3 and verse 8, if you're ahead of me. Now as Jan- Jannies and Jambres withstood Moses, so, so do these also resist the truth. Men of corrupt minds reprobate concerning the faith. Yeah. You know there are people that may claim the Lord, yet they'll fight. They'll fight the truth. And you know that to the city somebody uh, asked me, uh, what kind of Bible is this? I said King James. And uh, I look at it like that and then walk out. Why be afraid of that book, yeah? Mm -hmm. It'll help. You know, they, they, they want this book to be the one they want, not the one that the Lord wants for them. And uh, when they come by, they ask, what kind of book is this? Is it the one we use over here? It's usually no. It's not the one they use. You know, people are very rebellious, angry, maybe irritated, bitter, and even hate because of the book that we have, because of the church you're going to. So the neti di gabza to a yake. So cool, it is a link, is it a deyot khas, is it not? It's a dal ke, but a hat shat all a bit a tsi. Ado benahashi, a yo, lido in the court, a ina. A ke da deni. A hunch ene. Ah, it has a sheet lie, It would have been good for someone to see that. And then verse 8, verse 22. And I answer, Who art thou? It's good that he used the word who and not what. Who art thou, Lord? It's a good question. Do you see him? Do you hear him? Or do you know him? You know, this, this book was written by him and he's talking to you out of this book. And you can walk with him. He can uh, cleanse your life. He can help your life. He can uh, give you strength and victory and comfort and contentment and all, all things that can happen. Peace. Tranquility, honey, they are. In time like this, Okay, <laughs> But 
And he said unto me, I am Jesus of Nazareth, whom thou persecutest. Jesus of Nazareth, on a rocky chin, and he is at him. You know, the guy probably settled the problem right here. And, uh, you know, John 14 is a good example of uh, about another, talking about another way, uh, the same way that we're talking about uh, this way. 14.4 And whither I go, ye know, the Lord saying here, and the way ye know, Thomas said unto him, Lord, we know not whither thou goest, and how can we know the way? Jesus saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father, but by me, Nelia. Mm -hmm. Wow. There it is. How old ハーゴンヒスペタホズネラアドンタホンティトンヒスペタホズンタムスウォテンネボンネハハオスニヤオンヒスペアシタオンヒスペタホズンドアドハシタオエホンティギンヒスペホズンドネスナダナジーズウォ
at the Navy or Street, I call God a ya. Ah, ne, so, ne. Romans 10, 8, or less. I will look, look at the, these verses here. Uh, but what saith it? The word is nigh in thee, even in thy mouth. By the way, I read in John 5, 39, people think that they have life in the book, but they haven't found the Savior yet. So it's in your mouth, and then if it gets to your heart, hey, that's the time to react. That is the word of faith which we preach. I believe it was Mark or Luke that I read and just passed out. I think it's Luke. The soul, uh, so the seed, and the seed is the word of God. It KDA by Look here. Oh, KDA, eh, Yakapaza. You know, it's going to drop in your heart this morning. And then if you don't do anything about it, you know, Satan's going to take it out. And you won't have any feeling for God. And so. Back at Romans. <clears throat> Verse number 9, that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus. Uh, it's not saying somebody praying for you. He says you got to sound it out between those two pearly whites, yeah. Unless you have some imitation stuff, but you still sound something up between the out of your mouth, yeah. They mm -hmm. confess at the end of the day, they had to teach it. John, in Jaitla, they didn't know. John, you know that. People that I talk to, some of them have a head knowledge, but they don't want to put in the heart. Yeah, you You won't have any desire for Jesus if you don't put it in your heart. You know, Jesus is the one that that wants the fellowship with you. Believe in thine heart that God had raised him from the dead. Thou shalt be saved, for with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Now it's all trap. I forget a need or less. Ya also de ya sta ye. A coho e has zena bete has do tsi. Toby says do crata. Nana so do zena do need and zeto an in zeno. You know, some people just say, pray for me. You know, most of the time I say, I, I want this guy saved. I don't know why they want me to pray for them. But I do pray for some people, but I want them saved first before they can be right about what they're trying to do. And uh, so I hope you get something. You know, that it's the way that we're going, the way. You know, the other crowd is calling it this way, this way, their way. Mm -hmm. It's their way. It's our way. And what a way that we're walking this morning. Thank you. Heavenly Father, we just praise you again for the morning. 
Will you pray to help us uh, the rest of the day? Thank you. Will we pray in Jesus' name? Amen. We're going to end the service by singing All the Way My Savior Lead Me, page 296 in the Blue Songbook. Amen.